What's up, YouTube? My name is Sergio, and welcome to the official X underscore Deadwalker underscore X YouTube channel. Today, I'm going to be making a how to video on how to update your PlayStation 4 um, using the PlayStation 4 on the PlayStation 4. Uh, obviously, there's different ways to update it, but this is using the PlayStation 4. Obviously, you have to have it connected to the internet first step. Second, you have to, oh, actually, the first step is that you have to have the PlayStation 4 connected and on. Second, connected to the internet. Third, we'll continue on with this, but um, I'll, I'm, I'm gonna switch over to the actual console and we'll go from there. Uh, so this is how you're gonna update the PlayStation 4, and this is uh, making this video in light of the PlayStation 4 update 4.5 uh, releasing tomorrow uh, as of this recording. Today is the seventh or the eighth, I believe. So it's blah, 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 blah. so it's gonna release tomorrow. So again, this is how to update your PlayStation 4 uh, firmware. All right, so the first thing you do is uh, obviously turn it on. You're gonna go to settings. You're gonna go down to where it says system software update. And it's gonna check for the update. Obviously the update hasn't released yet, so we're not gonna get to that point, but it's gonna, right now, when there's no, when, you're, when your system's up to date, it's gonna say the latest version of the system software update, uh, of the system software is already installed. And you're good, that's it, you're done. But um, if there is an update, it's gonna ask you to download it. It usually automatically downloads, and uh, so it's gonna download the update. That's all you have to do. Once the download, once the update is done downloading, you're gonna have to go to where it says uh, notifications. You're gonna go down uh, where it says new, and once it's done downloading, it's gonna say uh, uh, needs. It's gonna say uh, finished downloading uh, needs to be installed. So you're gonna click on the update and follow the steps, and that's it. That's all you have to do. There's a couple warnings though. One, make sure uh, that you the PlayStation 4 is is connected to the power outlet securely. And that there's no chance of it unplugging and do not turn off the PlayStation 4 while it's installing. It's gonna corrupt the install and it's gonna break your PlayStation 4 and you're gonna have it's gonna be it's gonna be pretty tough to fix it. So oh well, not tough, but uh, it's gonna be a hassle to fix. Easy to fix, but a hassle either, regardless. Second, you don't oh, the the these uh unless you have it to unless you have your PlayStation 4 set up to download and update automatically, which I'll make another video on that. Uh, unless you have it to do it automatically, you have to do it on your own. So you don't have to necessarily update if you don't want to. Uh, it's recommended that you do because um, it's, these updates aren't just for features, even though the features are awesome and probably the best part, they also uh, are security updates. So um, just to keep that in mind, for those of you that are hesitant of updating or don't really want to update or don't see the need to update, I would. Uh, again, it's up to you. It's, uh, it's totally up to you if you update or not, but I would because um, because of the security updates, keep your system secure, keep your features updated and all that stuff, so that's pretty awesome. So, and that's that's pretty much it. That's all you guys have to worry about. Uh, once it's done installing, just turn your PlayStation 4 back on. If you, I believe it turns itself back on. Sign into your account and you're all good to go. Enjoy the new features and that's pretty much it. Uh, let, let me know down in the comments if you have any questions. Let me know down in the comments if you'd like me to make a tutorial on anything else. Doesn't matter how hard, how difficult, or how simple that um, question may be. Uh, there's no stupid question, guys. Go ahead and ask, and I'll try to make a video on it um, when I have time. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe, share, and comment. Enjoy your new update, 4.4 update on the PlayStation 4. Enjoy your new features, and um, that's it for this video, guys. Later.